Hi, I'm Wendy, and this is Wendy Drinks Gin. Cheers. Hi, welcome to Wendy Drinks Gin. Today I'm excited because I'm starting the floral section. So this will be my first floral gin. Um, I've always thought that the fruit and floral sections would be my favorite. The fruit certainly didn't disappoint, so now we're entering florals. And the floral is defined by light and delicate with fragrant sweets. So today I have Bloom Gin. Um, it smells like lavender, but I think that's because I have lavender in the glass. <laughs> Let's see what it tastes like. It, it kind of reminds me of a dry gin. Uh, nothing, I didn't taste anything special there. It's, it's a little harsh, not what I would think of a floral. Today's tonic is lemon tonic. Um, so it's a little cloudy. It seems to all settle to the bottom. So try to Actually, I think I'm probably going to need most of this today because it, it's a gin that is lacking after the fruit. And it's lacking what I thought that floral would be as well. But let's see what it's like with the lemon tonic. Well, it's pretty, the lavender. Um, it just, it, it really doesn't do anything for me. So. Let's read what the book says. Bloom is a floral London dry, oh I got that part right, dry gin inspired by nature. <clears throat> Chamomile, honeysuckle, and pomelo create a delicate gin. I don't think anything's delicate about it and I certainly didn't smell or taste honeysuckle. I don't really know what pomelo is, so I remember Eric and I looked it up earlier. Chamomile. No, I just smell and taste gin, and now lemon tonic. That's not true. I smell the lavender, which is really nice. So, I wouldn't recommend this one if you're looking for a floral gin. If that's what you're after, I missed it. And if it weren't for my lavender, I just don't think it would inspire me at all to, to say it's lavender, I mean to say it's uh, floral. But if you just like gin and tonic, I think this drink is going to be fine for you. Um, can't say there's anything really special about it, but I'm sure it would serve your purposes. So for me, I will not be having this one again, won't have it on my list and I don't recommend it, but I think you should give it a try and let me know what you think. So for today, this is Wendy. And I'll finish my gin. No need wasting this one. It is a good gin and tonic anyway, and it's got lovely lavender in it. Until next time, cheers.